guys welcome to let's just go we're back today with a special video can't wait I've been so excited for this one cheers so a little backstory I love knives I've loved knives for a long time I've always had blades around I've recently started getting some nice ones my babe got me this one last year for my birthday this year for my birthday, my brother ordered me a knife. And it just got here. My birthday was back in April. I don't know, what's today? June 10th. I've been waiting almost two months for this package. My brother ordered me a knife, told me it'd be a minute, but it's here. And I'm glad. So, went to work. I had to wait all day to open this. I had to go to work earlier. Like, I've been super excited to open this all day. Uh, but yeah, little story. Uh, I watch the Forge and Fire show all the time. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that show on, uh, I think it's the Discovery Channel or the History Channel. I don't, I don't remember. Yeah, I watched that Forge and Fire show. Man, is it cool. I love all the judges and the knives that them guys make. Some of them are really cool. Anyway, my brother got a hold of me one time and he said, Hey, I kind of know the guy that was on one of the episodes in one of the earlier seasons. He goes, and I know a kid that works for the guy in his forge. Dude, I got to give a shout out to Warfire Forge. Warfire Forge in uh, North Carolina. And uh, Mason Hamby. Mason, I haven't opened it yet, but man, we're getting ready to tear into this, and I cannot wait. Uh, so glad my brother hooked up with you to get me a knife. Uh, I'm going to hopefully get a hold of you guys and post this around and share your guys' work. But man, seriously, shout out to Warfire Forge and uh, Mason Hamby at, at their shop there in North Carolina. You know, let's break into this thing. I got to break out my tape gear again. You guys saw that in my last video. some old Glen Livet 14 that'd be a good bottle that'd be a good bottle to have I'm hoping it's not the bottle that's in here though let's see what we got Ooh, I see the I see the handle let's see the handle guys There's some nice crown royal bag sweet my brother knows I love crown royal too Got an extra Crown Royal bag to go with my collection. Oh, check out this sheath, guys. All handmade leather, it looks like. Just got a little belt loop on there. Belt hook so I can hang it on my belt. Dude, that's way sick. A little wrist action. Look at that. Dude, that's way cool. Man, look at this knife already. So rustic and cool looking. Get this back off here for a second. Let's take this thing out. Let's see what this looks like. Oh man. Look at that. Now that's a knife. And it's sharp, boy. <laughs> Look at the plate on that thing. Fits my hand really good. Look at that chopper, y'all. I don't know how long that is, but that's a long blade. Can you tell that's homemade? That's so sick. I gotta sharpen that down and grind it down. Handle's nice. Fits my hand good. It's not too heavy. It's balanced good. Man, that is so cool looking. Oh, 
I just want to poke myself. Yeah, that's badass. Man, Mason, thank you. Look at this knife. That is sick. Man, I can't wait to wear that around. <coughs> Man, tell me that's not going to look cool, guys. Mason at Warfire Forge, man. Oh, go check them out. Definitely suggest it. One of the guys at the shop there, I think he, he's, he might own the shop or something. He, he's been on the show, Forge and Fire. They know what they're doing over there. Man, I'm so happy. Look at this thing. Thank you very much, Jeff. Thank you very much, Mason. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Let's just go. Hey, guys. Welcome back today. Another session of Let's Just Go. I had to show off this knife again I got from my brother, guys. I know uh, my, my initial video shot last night when I got home from work. It was a little dark. And, uh, man, the way this knife is just rustic looking and, and old looking already, even though it's brand new, like, it was dark in that video, guys. So I had to show it off some more today. The, the sun's out, it's a nice bright day. Man, check out this knife. Again, thank you to Mason Hamby. This knife is badass, bro. I'm digging it. Everybody's gonna be jealous. Check out the sheath though. Man, this light. Get this pulled out of here real quick. angle it towards the light a little bit Dude, this knife is so huge it fits my hand perfect like I'm 6'3 250 like this thing fits my hand so nice I don't know if you guys can see the detail in this it's so old and crusty crazy like rustic looking it's original piece of steel though Pounded out by my homie Mason Hamby. You guys check him out. Check Mason Hamby out. Go get you a knife, man. He, he, he does some awesome work. And shout out to Warfire Forge. They've had a, had a guy from their shop uh, on the Forged and Fire show. So, yeah. My brother hooked me up with a bad knife, man. I can't wait to show it off. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks, Mason. I'm loving it.